you know, because you know, when, when, when you look at the fashion world now, it's very difficult to see people put African print for a dress in the, you know, in the fashion. You know, but now it's a trading. Everybody now, even Obama wife was putting the Africa print fabric on, you know. But I know the way I can design most of my collection and I make it very modern style with Africa print. You see? So the, 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 the youth would love to have that kind of thing. So when they are putting it on, they, they feel confident. Sorry, what do you wear? The name of your name. My name, the name. It's an African contemporary everything. I mix it. Yeah. And why do you wear African? Because I'm an African. Now our African culture is dying. It looks like everybody is in the Western. So I decided to look African. Like how do you differ yourself from other people? When, for instance, you are in a group and they took this kind of clothes, you make sure you saw the unique style. Yeah. You saw a common style. You want to me, I want my style will be different from among all of them. Then you will be looking at my own as well. Everybody will admire my own. I don't want to show some cheap style that you, you can copy it easily. So what are what are different styles? Oh, the different styles like this now. We have somebody who will not look on the calendar. He will not look at the uh, catalog. You know, the calendar and the catalog is common. But whereby the person can sketch, and use his own mind to create something. That one is a unique style. We mostly use the kente for traditional weddings there. But he designed it. What does kente mean for you? Well, it, it means royal. expresses our culture. It, it really is about the different kinds of fabric weaving together, weaving together. And this stands for unity. In our community, we all, what we want is we all live in peace. I wear this because I want to have a little flavor of the Western type and then our traditional time.